Gene here with the review on the Engine Sentai Go On Your Henshin Grip Wing Trigger. Yes, friends. Well, let's go ahead and start off with the box. Right here it says Engine Sentai Go On Your right here. And right here it says Henshin Grip Wing Trigger. And got Wing Trigger right here in English here. Right here got a nice shot of Go On Gold and Go On Silver, also known as Go On Wings. A nice window here of the Changer and the uh, Chain Soul. On top of the box, it's got the Go On Wings emblem there. On the bottom, a nice shot of Go On Go and Go On Silver. On the side of the box, another nice shot of the two. On the other side, a nice shot of the Wing Trigger and the uh, Chain Soul. And on the back of the box, friends, it just shows you everything and pretty much uh, everything we'll be seeing in this review. Alright, so friends, here it is, the Wing Trigger. And as the box stated, this is Go On Gold and Go On Silvers, also known as Go On Wings Transformation Device. The Wing Trigger is design of the stem for the Go On Wings gun, the Wing Booster. It is also used as the control stick for the Mechas. And pretty much it's design of a plain stick is what I'm trying to refer to. So let's go ahead and get into the heart with this change. So look here at we the go. wing trigger. The color scheme of the wing trigger is pretty much a flat gray. So here's a uh, here's the, all the gray and everything. And then it's got some red here, and then uh, red here where the button for the henchin is, right there. And then uh, it, it's got some silver and some yellow, pretty much going with the color scheme of both go on gold and go on uh, silver. So um. Anyway, we'll uh, take a look at the keypad here, and I hate to burst your bubble, friends, but these aren't pushable. Uh, it's just a, it's a keypad, it's a foily sticker, and of course, it's just, you know, it's just got the numbers, and that's it. Uh, and then uh, right at the bottom, it says G50NG, which means uh, go on wings, and right here it says ES system, so engine soul system, so another changer that deals with the engine soul system here. Then uh, right here, that's the uh, Go Onger's emblem right here, not done in a nice silver here. And uh, on the same side, uh, on the other side as well. And then uh, here is the trigger. And then uh, here's where all the sounds come from. Now this piece here does activate the sounds of the three engines and so on. But if you slide it, it does activate the sound. And you'll see that a little later on in this review. But uh, anyway, right here it says GWGX. And so, uh, pretty much means uh, GW is for Go On Silver, and GX is for Go On Silver, I mean, Go On Gold, excuse me. And I think uh, the W and the X pretty much symbolizes what's on their visor. Like, uh, Go On Silver has the W, and Go On Gold has the X. And then right here, it's got uh, ES System, you know, uh, Engine Soul System. And then uh, this piece here uh, has the Go On Wings uh, emblem right here. It does come down. This is uh, mainly whenever you do the whole deal with the uh, Rocket Dagger. But uh, anyway, and of course, here is the uh, the button that does the henchin. And it does have the uh, emblem up, uh, for the Go Ongers. Now on the top, you know, pretty much the wing trigger is like a cell phone here. But you can see you got the uh, cell phone feature here. You got the battery, the uh, mail the bars and the ES for I guess the icon for engine soul and so you know this is pretty much where the uh, the dagger part does connect on and uh, one day I'll get the uh, wing booster one day so uh, anyway and also this piece here when you push this down this pops open this is where you put the uh, chain soul at so anyway so just like the uh, go phone and the shift changer, I'm gonna just show you a little something here. I'm gonna open this part up, and I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna have two different lights shine in, just to give you a, a, a glimpse. You know, pretty much whenever I hit this button here, you should be able to see something moving. And I'll get a little closer. So I got a light there. So yeah, something is definitely moving in there, and uh, that's pretty much how the functions from the uh, chain soul will work and uh, you'll see that a little later on in this review and uh, you know pretty much inside they have something that will uh, will 
um, hit the pins and activate the sound. So that's what I'm trying to get to at. But uh, anyway. So here is the uh, chain sole that comes with the wing trigger. And so as you can see, it's a little bit different from the last two. And I'll show them to you in a little bit. But uh, anyway, you can see got the go on wings emblem right here. You know, the go on your emblem and some wings added. So going along with the go on wings emblem here. Got the nice red background here. It's got change here. And then uh, ES and then o, uh, OG right here. There's your lights right there. And we'll take a look at the back here. Uh, once again, just like the other two, it takes the uh, LR44 batteries here. It's got my little tab here, so there are no sounds right now. But, uh, and here is the speaker for where all your sounds come from. And then uh, here, are the, here is the, uh, the buttons and the pins to activate all the sounds. And you'll see that a little later on in this review. But uh, anyway, let's get the other two out for a minute here. And so here are the difference. Here's all three chain soles. The one, um, this one for the uh, three go ongers and then uh, uh, black and green, and then go on wings. And so you can see pretty much, you know, got the uh, blue background, the green background, the red background, the go on your emblem, and the go on wing emblem here. And you can see, uh, you know, uh, this one here's got ESOP. This one here's got ESOB. And uh, this one's got ESOG. So that's the three chain soles here. So now let's go ahead and do the sounds uh, with the wing trigger and the uh, chain sole. Of course, I said this in the last uh, two reviews, but pretty much the wing trigger uh, is a worthless piece of plastic without this, the uh, chain sole. That's pretty much how it's been going with, with this Sentai's gimmick or changers, uh, pretty much. So let's go ahead and do the sound. So we'll hit this button here. So standard sound here. So let's go ahead and uh, uh, put the engines, uh, the chain so in. So let's go ahead and do this. So chain so set. It makes that noise. So let's do it again. So now let's go ahead and do the hinge in. So let's do it. Let's go on. And you can see all the lights coming through your screen right here. So let's go ahead and do the uh, hinge in one more time. So here we go. So it's it's a different hinge in sound than uh, the last fives changer, but anyway, uh, pretty much giving us, you know, the sounds because they are go on wings. So the sound of helicopters flying and so on. So um, now anyway. the next sound I'm going to go ahead and do is just hit the trigger here. Makes like a searching sound. And let me warn you right here, for some reason, my engine... My uh, chain sole does go haywire here for some ungodly reason. So just bear with me here. So let's hit the uh, trigger again. So does it do anything while I hold the trigger? Nope. So uh, the next thing we'll go ahead and do is do a call mode. So hopefully this will work with me here. So here we go. And you the trigger. So pretty much the three engines here whenever you do that call mode. And you know you have Triptor, Jetris, and Jumbo Whale sound doing their bata 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 and Geen and Boyle. And uh, I don't know why my... Uh, change so goes haywired here sometimes but uh, I'm gonna definitely uh, show it uh, you know show the uh, change so um, it without this changer you know being in this changer for sure so anyway now, as promised friends I'm gonna go ahead and do the sounds with the change so out of the uh, changer so uh, pretty much now we're gonna be doing this with our usual sounds here 
course, we got these pins at the bottom here, so we're going to go ahead and hit them both at the same time. So here we go. And so we're going to go ahead and hit, uh, see what happens when we just hit this one side. So here we go. So that's the searching, the search mode. So I'm going to go ahead and kind of tilt this a little bit because I'm going to use my paper clip here. Um, and this side mainly, so uh, I don't mess up here. So here is uh, this side, uh, the this side's pin right here. So here's what happened when we hit this side. And then uh, again. And one more time. So pretty much uh, this side, uh, the scan, and then uh, this side, the engines, and then, you know, the uh, two uh, pins push down does the engine. So that's how this works. Well, friends, my final thoughts on the wing trigger. It is a decent, decent changer. It's not one of my personal favorite, but I do like the sounds that come off of the uh, engine, the, the uh, chain sole, you know, the engine, the scanning sound. And the sounds of the, the uh, three engines of the go on wings. So um, I really, uh, really uh, do uh, dig the sounds off of that. But like I said, this is not one of my personal favorite. I mean, I, I know I'm a big time uh, fan of the six inches, but this one doesn't really take it. I mean, um, I mean, you're, you're, you're pretty much seeing that it's a design of a plain stick, pretty much. Uh, and, you know, pretty much this is mainly for their mechas and mainly the uh, stem of their weapon, their gun, the wing booster. So, like I said, it's okay. Don't knock me on and everything. I mean, I, I'm still a fan of Go Wongers, mainly on all three changers that we got here. So, but um, anyway, so, yeah, I do uh, like this and um, I would definitely say I do highly recommend this changer. If you are a diehard Go On Your Fan, pick this up. It will go nicely with your shift changer in the Go Phone. Don't pass it up if you are a uh, diehard fan of Go On Your or mainly Go On Wings, pretty much, you know? But uh, anyway, so good luck on trying to find this nice changer. I mean, I'm going to say it is a nice changer and uh, I will say happy hunting. And so friends, that is it for this review. Please check out my blog, follow me on Twitter, and to like my Facebook. And if you like this review, please smack that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. And please, friends, uh, hit that bell icon to be notified on when I upload a new video. And so friends, this review on the Engine Sentai Go Andre Hinch and Grip Wing Trigger. I hope you enjoy. And my friends, I'm Eugene. I'm signing out with a good day. And friends, almost assuredly, see you next time. Bye, my friends.